Okay, let's begin writing code. Now, the first thing I've done is created a new file called sendText.py. And as you can see, this file is empty for now. Then if you go to Twilio's installation page, oh, by the way, this link is also available on the instructor notes. If you scroll down on this page, you will notice that Twilio has provided some sample code that allows us to send text messages to our phone. Now, I just want to run and see if this code even works. If this program does work, only then will I try and understand how it actually sends a text message to our phone. So for now, all I'm gonna do is copy this code and go back to my send text program and paste that code. Okay, so it seems that the code is importing Twilio. Although it is a little different than what we have seen thus far. There is this keyword here called from, which we haven't seen before. I will return to this later. Okay, if you read the next two lines in the program, they talk about account SID and authorization token. Now, these must be for Twilio to figure out who I am, almost like my username and password. So let's go to the Twilio website and figure out these two values.